So maybe you're thinking about buying a CST Pro 100 Chummer Chunker, or maybe you already bought one. Well, let me go through some amazing things about this because your days offshore fishing are about to get much better. This is an amazing product with a multitude of different tactics to catch great offshore fish. Inside the box, you're gonna find a product that was made to top specifications. All stainless steel, heavy duty, and built in America. This is a great product for all you guys out there going offshore fishing. This is gonna change the way you fish. The CST Pro 100 Chummer Chunker works in a multitude of different ways, anywhere from filling completely with live baits, to cut up chunk baits, to even your cut up fine ground tournament chum that you're gonna use for your snappers and your smaller fish. The different styles of chum used in this will be for targeting your different species. For example, the guys up in New England and up in New York and those New Jersey way offshore fishing those canyons for those big tuna, they love the chunker. The chunker was actually developed by those people. They fill this thing up with big chunks of bunker in Manhattan and they're able to drop this back into those canyons to chum up those big blue fin, those big eyes and those yellow fin out there way offshore. The controlled feed from the Pro Chunker enables you to deliver just the right amount of baits when you want to let them out. The bottom folds open, drops a few chunks at a time, and you control the feed. That way you're not there just feeding those big tuna and sending fish off full. Another incredible aspect of the Pro 100 Chummer Chunker is we can fill this full of live baits. These live baits get in here, they're thrashing around, they're putting out distress signals, sound that these fish hear. Instead of just taking your baits and broadcasting them around the boat, we put them in the Pro Chunker and it keeps a hold of them while they make the sound. We're able to drop it down into the deeper water and create all that noise, all that flash, and still get the scent coming out. It works incredible. Then when I need a few live baits to pop out and do a little bit of working for me. Couple pulls on the tether and away a few go. Works out absolutely incredible. This actually creates a third dimension, folks. This is gonna give you sound. This is gonna work up current and in areas where the chum smell and the slick is not working for you. The sound works and pulls fish in. It's an amazing, amazing technique. Another very popular use down here in the Keys and all through Florida is for mangrove and those big yellowtail snapper. You're gonna fill this thing full of your tournament chum, pack it full all the way to the top. You can drop this thing down as far as you want. You can drop it down 100 feet or 50 feet or even 10 feet below the boat. It's a beautiful item that you can do that. It's built heavy duty or it's not gonna get beat up. Nothing's gonna tear it up and you can get it down there and get your chum in to where those snappers and those big, really finicky yellowtails that are hard to get up off the bottom. Couple pulls on the rope, just the right amount of chunks go out. Really gets those big yellowtails and mangs fired up. And it's just a super product for your big offshore snapper trips. One more application we use is for grouper and cobia and just your overall predator fish that are out there. We're gonna cut the baits up into chunks. We're gonna put them in there and we're gonna use it typically like the tuna guys up in the New England area do. But we're gonna be targeting our grouper, possibly cobia, amberjack, things like that. We're gonna fill it with the big chunks. We're gonna drop it down on the wreck and we're gonna pump the bottom. It's a very neat feature, folks. It's got a very tight spring, only lets just the right amount of baits out at a time. Works incredible for those grouper trips or pulling in those big cobia. It works in a multitude of directions. Another great trick for the cobia, don't forget, put those live, put a couple live baits in there with your chum to create a little bit of sound and a surround for that perfect bite. You'll pull those fish in that otherwise might not have known you were there. Couple more important things that you're gonna to need to know about your CST Pro 100 Chummer and Chunker is the fact that you can lock the bottom plate in. Don't think that the only way that this thing works is with the sliding bottom. If you wanna keep the chum in here, maybe keep the chunks in, you're looking for a scent dispersion only, Put a pin in here, simple cotter pin installation in this little tab will keep the bottom plate from coming out. Nice feature to have. Actually, that gives you the chummer chunker. The chummer is with it locked, the chunker is with it open. Works out great. Gives you two different ways of using your chummer chunker. 
A very important thing with your chum or chunker is picking a different type of lanyard that you're going to use. I've chosen a very heavy duty unit down here in Florida where we have problems with big sharks and goliath grouper and things actually eating the chum or chunker. I take my heavy duty lanyard, I'm going to put this on. This is going to give me maximum control of this. It's a thousand pound tether. Nothing is going to break that off and nothing is going to pull the chum or chunker loose. Works out great. Now another thing that some people are saying is maybe that big rope will keep the chum or chunker from getting down in the tide. When the tide is really, really ripping, sometimes it can push the chum or chunker out a little bit behind the boat. There's a couple things you can do. You can go down to a lighter lanyard. Some of the captains up in the northeast area are even going to a chain, which still gives you the super heavy durability and also gives you the weight to get the chum or chunker down. You can also add weights to the chum or chunker. This is an additional item that you put purchase for this helps get that chummer down, the kite's really, really ripping, keeps it heavy, keeps it straight down below the boat and down there at that desired depth, not back there in the tide flopping around out of the way. So keep that in mind when you're using your chummer chunker. This is a very effective tool to make your days offshore very successful.